مرحبا مس جي جيز اوسم ايت جريد ستودنتس كيف حالكم بخير شكرا بيكوز يو جوين توديز ريكوردد ليسون بويز اند جيرلز ان ذس ليسون وي ار جوينج تو لوك ات ذا ديفرنت جوبز ذات يو اوريدي ليرند جوينج تو هاف ا كويك ريفيو اند ذن وي ويل بي ليرنينج هاو تو اسك كويستشنز وذر ذس a person is a doctor or whether she is a nurse or whether he is a, a teacher or whether she is a lawyer. And you're go going also to learn how to answer by yes, naam, or no, kalla. Also, boys and girls, in this lesson, you are going to learn adjectives to give to these professions or jobs all right shukran again for joining in and hiya nabda right boys and girls let us start by, by reviewing the six jobs that you already learned both in their masculine and feminine forms tabib tabiba tabib tabiba doctor huwa tabib He is a doctor. Hiya tabiba. She is a doctor. Muallim. Muallima. Teacher. Huwa muallim. Hiya muallima. Muhandis. Muhandis. Muhandisa. Engineer. Huwa muhandis. هي مهندسة محامي محامية lawyer هو محامي هي محامية ممرد ممرضة هو ممرد هي ممرضة فنان فنانة artist هو فنان هي فنانة so you notice boys and girls that every time I, I say like I do not add the a ah here at the end or the ta the silent ta in Arabic it I am talking about a male a profession given to a male And when I'm saying the A ah at the end, it is a profession that I am giving to a, to a female, you know? Like, and then I say huwa, huwa is for male, hiya is for female. Huwa tabib, he is a doctor, hiya tabiba. All right, boys and girls? Now, let's go to the next slide where you will learn how to ask questions about uh, professions. So the learning targets for this new lesson is I can make questions using a he or she to ask about jobs. Remember boys and girls that in Arabic uh, we uh, uh, we say uh, like the ending of the word changes depending if the subject is feminine or masculine, right? Uh, and also you will learn how to ask questions and answer but he, with yes, he is or no, he is not. Ye yes, she is and no, she is not. All right, let's have a look at what the next slide has for us. Hey, boys and girls, let's have a look at this slide and go through it step by step. Number one, this is in Arabic is Hua, hua, like he is hua, he is a doctor, hua tabib, hua is he is hua tabib. She is in Arabic is hiya, hiya tabiba. Just like you heard me say in the previous, uh, at the beginning of this lesson, hua tabib. He is a doctor. He is a doctor. He is a 
الطبيب هي طبيبة هو فنان هي فنانة هو فنان هي is an artist هي فنانة she is an artist did you notice boys and girls هو طبيب هو is masculine طبيب does not end with the a the sound of a هي طبيبة you have the a here for هي automatically طبيب becomes طبيبة because it is feminine هو فنان he is an artist هو فنان هي فنانة هي فنانة alright so step number two is how we ask a question whether uh, uh, like she is a doctor she is a painter she is a singer or if he is a lawyer etc etc so in Arabic when you want to say uh, for example is he a doctor or is she a lawyer we say هل هو هل هو هل هو هل هو means is he هل هو طبيب هل هو طبيب is he a doctor هل هي طبيبة هل هي طبيبة see boys and girls the new word is هل هل هو هل هي is he is she but also listen when I am using the job keyword, I am also uh, keeping it like masculine or feminine depending on the subject that I have. هل هو طبيب? Is he a doctor? He is masculine. طبيب is masculine. هل هي طبيبة? Is she a doctor? هي is feminine and tabiba is feminine too all right and the number three step number three the answer would be nam for yes or la for no nam la boys and girls when we meet in class virtual i have prepared for you a documentation that i will also put on google classroom and it has you know activities about all this this is just a recorded lesson but in class you will be we will be doing many activities games and uh, you know uh, oral and written exercises about all this all right so let me give you another example for this let's say i wanna uh, choose the profession of muhandis Mohandis again is engineer. Mohandis. So I'm going to say, Hal huwa Mohandis? Hal huwa Mohandis? Hal hiya Mohandisa? Hal hiya Mohandisa? Naam. La. All right, boys and girls. Thank you for following. Let's have a look at our next slide these are exercises about how to ask and answer questions let's look at the first part of this slide you can see a teacher over here and the question is هل هي معلمة? what does that mean هل هي معلمة? is she a teacher did you see how i said here معلمة? Because it's a she. هل هي معلمة? نعم. هي معلمة. Yes. She is a teacher. هل هي معلمة? نعم. هي معلمة. Okay, let's look at the second part of the slide. I see the same picture. But the question is different. هل هي مهندسة? مهندسة again is lawyer. هل هي مهندسة? 
Is she a lawyer? La. No. Hiya muallima. La. Hiya muallima. No. She is a teacher. Hal hiya muhandisa? La. Hiya muallima. Please notice that all the endings of uh, of the questions or the sentences are related to the main subject, whether it is male or female. All right, boys and girls. This activity over here, I shared it with you on Google Classroom, and I would like for you to complete it and submit it. And But let's have a look and do it together here in this recording. I see here four pictures and four different uh, professions. And next to each picture is written a profession. We are going to ask the question, just like the previous slide, to see whether the profession that is written here and the picture are the same. All right? Pay attention to feminine and masculine. All right. What do I have here? I have here a muhandis. Muhandis. And here it says mumarrid. Muhandis mumarrid. Remember, muhandis is uh, an engineer. Mumarrid is a nurse. My first question is going to be, هل هو مهندس? I mean, excuse me. هل هو ممرد? هل هو ممرد? لا. لا. هو مهندس. هل هي فنانة? نعم. هي فنانة. هل هي طبيبة؟ نعم. هي طبيبة. هل هو محامي؟ نعم. هو محامي. Okay, so now we're going to learn uh, how to list adjectives describing, you know, different jobs. So the learning target will be I can list adjectives to describe someone and I can change the adjectives from masculine to feminine. All right, boys and girls, hiya bina nabda. Let's start learning a list of six adjectives, both for uh, in their masculine and feminine forms. Tabib had, boys and girls, had is calm. <coughs> Excuse me. Tabib had a calm doctor. Tabib had Muhami the key. The key is smart. The key. The key. Mumarrid nasheet. Nasheet. Mu'allim sabur. Sabur. Patient. Fanan mawhub. Mawhub. Talented. Muhandis tamuh. Tamuh. Ambitious. The study guide is uh, will be shared with you, of course, and is on Google Classroom. Let's read one more time our new adjectives. Had, had, calm, veki, veki, smart, nasheet, nasheet, active, sabur, sabur, patient. Mawhub, mawhub, talented, tamuh, tamuh, ambitious. Always, in order to change from the masculine to feminine, we add the a or the silent tab al Arabi. Tamuh, tamuha, mawhub, mawhuba, dhaki, dhakiya, nashit, nashita, sabur, sabura, wahad, hadia. Shukran jazilan, boys and girls, for tuning in, and I will see you in class. Shukran. Ma salama.